It's our top story tonight at 6. We've got major delays on Interstate 65 following a crash this afternoon. That crash initially shut uh, down both directions of the interstate. News 18's Perry Postalacos is live in Clinton County where the highway has been closed this afternoon. She joins us now with the latest developments in the crash. Perry. Hey there, Jeff and Marley. That's right. I actually just received word from Indiana State Police Sergeant Jeremy Pierce that one person is dead and another person was taken to an Indianapolis area hospital after that head on collision between two semi trucks on I 65 earlier this afternoon. Right now we are at State Road 52 East and State Road 57. You can see a lot of the traffic from the closure that resulted from that crash has actually come to this area and Indiana State Police Sergeant Jeremy Pierce says I-65 southbound is closed to State Road 28. Northbound is closed to State Road 47. The backup on the southbound side has been cleared out between the crash scene and the closure, and they are working on clearing the northbound traffic now. And it actually has been Preliminary investigation has shown that this is a three vehicle crash. The third car is just a passenger car that sustained minor damage and that driver is uninjured. Preliminary investigation shows that a southbound semi truck went through a median and crashed into a northbound semi truck on I-65 and those closures on I-65 should last at least a couple more hours and right back here on State Road 52 East and State Road 47 as you can see behind me there has been a police officer directing traffic for quite some time you can see the flashing lights on the police car there as long as we've been here for about a half hour or so you can see and uh, along this side of State Road 47. You can see multiple semi trucks kind of sitting in a standstill. Traffic is not moving too quickly. However, it is moving. Now that's all I have from Clinton County here reporting live. I'm Perry Apostolakos, News 18.